Hi, I'm Carrie. And I'm Dee Dee. And this is the Carrie and Dee Dee Show. Hello. So tonight we viewed the Basketball Wives reunion. I gotta say that I think Dee Dee and I both feel like it, it was it was slightly boring. It, it's sort yeah. of like it's 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 gonna build up to something right. because it has to go somewhere from here, especially to have two weeks. You know, to make us wait another week to see yes, what's next. Part, yeah. But I love, love, love Evelyn's parts where she <laughs> like, security, security, get this bitch out of here. That was my favorite part thus far. I, I, I didn't like that fact that they were playing Royce to the left though, because last what the season before last it seemed like they were all cool then all of a sudden somehow they turn into arch enemies and then this year is like Royce doesn't matter I, and I'm trying to figure out how do we get from they're a little jealous of Royce I think really I think they're a little you know jealous of her in a way I mean I don't know it's so much stuff that's probably going on uh, behind the scenes that we don't get to see and you know they're not saying everything. So if, if there's a lot of stuff going on behind the scenes, when Roy says something, say, oh, you said this, and she say, and Evelyn says, oh, I didn't say that. Bitch, you said this, and bitch, you, bitch, you this, and you that. It's some stuff that's going on that, you know, everybody don't know about. So it makes, you know, everybody look crazy. But I think they're a little jealous of Royce. I don't know. Well, well, what Because last year, it seemed like a what? Royce what? had a uh, fashion show. And then everything turned left from there. And I'm like... Oh, you know what? I think Evelyn and Jennifer were some shady bitches for that. Because that was supposed to be your girl. And you were supposed to be supporting her and showing up to her event. And at the end, last minute, they was like, those clothes are ugly. And I don't, you know, I don't want to wear that. So to me, I thought they were shady in that. If they, was, if they were truly her friends, they should have went and supported her regardless. You know, so... I don't know. After that, then Royce, you know, felt like they were fake and they weren't genuine, and that's why I think part of the, you know, they started changing. But um, my girl Tammy, Tammy, I think everything that Tammy told Mika was the truth. I don't know how Mika is looking at this situation or where, you know, what's her thought, her thought, thought pattern. But I think Mika was, I mean, not Mika, oh my gosh. I think Tammy was right in the things that she told Mika. Mika came in not knowing anyone, and she just was going off what she heard people say, saying, like, oh, you're a dancer, and, and this and this, and we can't trust you, or whatever. I don't know. She formed her opinion without even, you know, getting to know the girl. So I think you, I don't think you should ever do that. I don't think you should come on to the scene where you just start judging somebody based on what someone else is saying because they mean the other person may not like her so they're going to say negative things so you you have to meet the person and form your own opinion so that's where mika messed up first off she just came in talking like she knew everybody but she didn't so that's my take on that tammy told her the right thing the show to me was kind of boring but my favorite thing my favorite parts is everything tammy everything tammy that's my favorite part i think that Mika came in wrong because she should have learned the persons, just like you said, as opposed to taking TV and edits. Because I can edit something and make you look like a horrible person on on um, yeah on YouTube. It's just just edit all the good the good stuff out and leave all the bad stuff, and it just make you look crazy. Mm -hmm. I, I think she she's too. Tunnel vision, and she don't, she doesn't see that there are more people in the world than her. Because the way she talks is like she could be a really good girl to be around. Right, but it's just she doesn't give ch chance for there to be a conversation as much as she's saying what she has to say, and hopefully some of her points fall in the right spot so that you think that she's nice. She came at she came at Royce wrong. She came at Tammy wrong. Meeting Tammy and seeing her on TV is kind of different. I'm I'm assuming because I've never been in Tammy's presence, but she should have talked to one instead of like, "Why are you so mad?" Instead of you know, "Oh, she's low down." Like, Why are you so mad? Why are you like this? What you know? You could have built a a real relationship instead of 
saying, oh, she, I know I'm, I'm going gonna to be, I'm going to have some uh, arch enemies. And then to find out that Shawnee or nobody invited her on the show. She literally invited herself, which I really think that's a G move to come on some body show and say, bitch, I'm just going to be on the show and I got yeah, enough I connections. Was, yeah, to, to, yeah. <laughs> I got enough connections to make but sure I that I'm on the show. Because Shorty was quiet the whole time. It's yeah, like, because she knows some more to this story. Yeah, she, But I think um, because she was able to forge her way to the show that way, she thought she could forge her way into those friendships like that mm -hmm. or the circle or whatever you want to call it. And it just didn't happen that way. That's not how you do it. I, I always thought the minute she came on the show, she was talking too fucking much. She was talking, 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 talking. Tammy told her right when she said, you know what? You should have stepped back. This You would have been smarter if you would have stepped back and paid attention to everybody and knew and, sh and, and peeped everybody so you would know who's on what, who's where, what's going on, and then you could have played it better. She didn't do that. She just busted and talking and thought automatically she was going to build some type of friendship, not with Tammy and Royce, but with Jennifer and Evelyn, Evelyn and Shawnee. That's the, that's the clique she wanted to be in. But they are in a clique, if you ask me. But I, I think so. on, if you go back and watch the old shows, you'll see Shawnee seems like I'm standing back because, bitch, I don't really know you, and I didn't put you in this. You went above my head, so this is what you get. I'm not going to welcome right. you in because everybody else was welcomed in. Tammy was walked in. Come on, and you know, this is mm -hmm. Tammy. Everybody else walked in. This bitch was not walked in. And no one, going back to, to uh, Royce, because I'm still lost on this. Shawnee is the one who wanted Royce on the show. For Shawnee to go and, and, and backstab her like that, what the fuck? But she did say, you know, she had her feelings about Royce, and it is what it is, but. I don't think she's as deep into it, or maybe she is. I think, I think, you know what I think about Shawnee? I think she's behind the scenes doing the dirt. I really do. I think she's behind the scenes saying what she have to say or creating it. You know what? And then I don't know with her because maybe, you know, she's just trying to make her money. Maybe huh? she's just le letting it all get crazy so she could, you know, just keep on getting the shows rolling. In many ways, I maybe feel like the guy who side. hosts the uh, re reunions. I'm a straight man sitting in Yeah, I'm a straight John man Sally. sitting in the middle of, of, of some shady women she shit. Love it. But, but no, like it's it not the love people. part of it. It's like we don't it's really be knowing what's going on because it takes a gay man to get in the middle of this and know what's happening. Because yeah. <laughs> straight men be right. like, why y'all, you liked her. It's like he don't get it sometimes. You he brought her in funny. and now you, you, you're shading her? And whose show is this? How does this bitch get on? You know what? Because that's how we are. We're like, Cut and dry, cut and dry, cut and dry. Royce was getting some attention the on the first season. She you know, was getting Royce attention on the first and the second season. Yeah. And this time, she's totally edited out the show. Twelve shows well, went by, and I barely saw Royce. At all. It's a few little episodes here. And then they put, um, talk them up a lot. Well, Mika, she, 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 she put, she barged in her. And I'm like, so, is Mika right. coming back? Uh, Tammy said if me could come back, she ain't coming back. Tammy or Evelyn? Tammy. Tammy. Tammy said she's not coming back if Mika comes back. She said she will not work with somebody that's suing her. Mm -hmm. And, and so that's we'll no more see. than fair, but of course, Mika can say, look, um, did you Wait punch me what in my head? Is this the second season? Or the, this is the third season. The third. It's going to be the fourth mm -hmm. season now. They're like, did you punch me in my head? You, you made me look bad on TV. She's suing her. I'm like, I, I don't... And she'll probably win the lawsuit. I, I wish that I could delve into this and kind of really understand this, but this is some shady yeah. shit. But you know what? It's 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 reality TV. That's it. Yeah. Let's not forget. It's just it's but, it's reality TV. It's not it's it's not all the way reality. It's 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 made to look like everything's real. Probably none of them are really friends no. at all. You know. So, but I tell you this much though, I will be watching next week because. Shade like this has to get nasty. They need to amp it up. I, I just, hope it don't end up like um, the Atlanta Housewives when it just just is like blank and people looking at each other don't want to say somebody shit. Somebody had a lawsuit. And they yeah, talk. Like, I can't talk and actually. I don't want to say anything. And Tammy got on that table. When Tammy got on that table, I'm like, Tammy, get your ass back, please. You're already in trouble for getting close to this. We don't want you anywhere next to this bitch. She crazy. Huh? <laughs> back up. Back up off of this bitch, please. Belly, please, yeah. because it's no good. Tammy no good. is a mess, but I love her. 
I, I, I like I, the way they tried to soften the Evelyn up, but Evelyn ain't soft. Evelyn is hard. And <laughs> she not hard. They really. trying to soften her up by putting a daddy in and giving her a crying scene. And the Jennifer situation, I, I don't... Jennifer, I don't know something about Jennifer. I just... Jennifer, cool, it, but I do agree with um, Royce when she say Evelyn, uh, Jennifer is up Evelyn's ass. Because I do kind of see that. I think she just says whatever Evelyn says. It's like, it's almost as if she's not her own person. Like, and I think she would be so so much better if you know if she would just come out of that and just be who she really is and I'm, not. I really Evelyn. believe I that know. she she's been sheltered a whole lot. She and, she she's, and she's right. trying she to reach out to grab something. It, it is a little aggravating yeah, because it's like, like you, act like you she, should be you should be leading these bitches. You should need she, to be a, a a background person. You should be leading this. You should be the voice. Of, she looked like she could be the voice of reason in a situation, but she's kind of. Playing behind Evelyn, right? And she don't need to do that. It's even Royce almost seemed like she was gonna be under Tammy, but they seem like they're in two different worlds. And actually, I didn't like the the seating of all the women because it's like, why is Tammy over here by these bitches? Why don't she? Well, they gotta put. Royce. Oh yeah, Mika. Because Mika don't get along. Mika wanted to be in the other circle. Yeah, with and Royce don't get along with girl. any of them bitches. So it's, right, so that they all over there. Mika in between her and Royce. Because it looks like the light skin chicks are over here. One white girl and two and two dark skinned chicks. So it just seemed weird. So the circle that Mika really wanted to be in is it's in with, with uh with Roy. I mean with uh. And I don't think that shit's going to be repaired. So no. she's out. Hopefully she no. doesn't come back. Yeah, but we can actually do without her because she just came in with that shit and stirred up some mess. But it was like you got hit in the face, girl, the nose, whatever you got hit, and it didn't look too good. Mm -hmm. It didn't look good. So at we all. don't need no more of you, <laughs> girl. But. That's our take for this week. Next week, we're going to come back again because they've stretched this Part out. Two. And we're going to give y'all some more. And um, we look forward to, you know, talking to y'all again. And let us know what y'all think. If you watched the uh, Basketball Wives reunion, let us know what you think about it. What you thought about the whole thing. Cause, yeah, you know, that way we can do a post to, to you know, go back off was, with your comments. You know, it something. was okay. Like, you know, it's reality TV. Yeah, because it, right but, now the summer is over and look like TV has gone to hell. And for real. It's, like, and it's getting hard. If it went for our hoarders and these um, strange <laughs> addictions, child, I wouldn't know what to watch. I'm going to tell you, it's, it's getting hard. Hopefully the summer is, we know the summer is not really over, but kids are back in school. Hopefully the fall yes. will give us some real stuff to yes. talk about, y'all. Oh well, yeah, but this there's this new show I can't think of the name, but it's with these big girls. Oh yeah, I'm gonna be watching that, and I can't wait because <laughs> I hope it's good because I uh, will let you guys know about it because um it's called these big girls. It's like they don't want to be skinny, and baby, I don't know what they're gonna be doing, but I'm gonna let y'all know about that because I'm interested. I think it's in the coming on in like a couple of weeks. Let me know if y'all know what I'm talking about. These big girls gonna be dancing or modeling. Models. Mm. Oh, yeah. All right, y'all. Y'all have a good one. And we'll see you next week.